welcome to aminacademy.com in organic chemistry let us discuss about alkyl group alkyl group is formed by removing a hydrogen atom from the molecule of alkene alkenes are quite often represented by rh and here r stands for alkyl group the general formula of the alkyl group is cnh2n plus 1 look at here here C here four C's and hydrogen is connected. Removal of one hydrogen, it becomes like so. It is a alkyl group from alkene to alkyl alkyl group. Removal of one hydrogen. If you imagine removing a hydrogen atom from an alkene, the partial structure that remains is called alkyl group. Alkyl groups are not stable compounds themselves. They are simply parts of larger compounds. Alkyl groups are named by replacing the AN, A -N -E, ending of the parent alkene and an OIL, IL ending. For example, removal of hydrogen from methane, that is CH4, generates a methyl group like CH3. And removal of hydrogen from ethane, that is CH3, CH3, it generates an ethyl group that is CH2, CH3. Similarly, removal of a hydrogen atom from the end of carbon of any straight chain alkene gives the series of straight chain alkyl group. Combining an alkyl group with any of the functional group listed earlier makes it possible to generate and name many thousands of compounds. For example, methane, uh, one hydrogen is removed from methane, it's group, methyl group. Then adding, uh, removing one hydrogen and adding OH, it becomes methyl alcohol, that is methanol. Now we will discuss further about what is an alkyl group. Alkyl group is formed by removing a hydrogen atom from the molecule of alkene. Alkene are quite often represented by RH and here R stands for alkyl group. General formula of alkyl, alkyl group is CnH2n plus 1 because one hydrogen less from alkene. The smallest alkyl group is called CH3 called methyl. A cycloalkyl is derived from a cycloalkane by removal of hydrogen from a ring. The general form of cycloalkyl is CnH2n minus 1. Now, some table of contents of alkyl groups will discuss. Nomenclature of alkyl groups. An, an alkyl group is named by replacing the suffix N of the alkane with suffix of oil that is alkyl CH4 C and CH3 it becomes CH3 removing one hydrogen it becomes CH3 that is called alkyl now methane becomes methyl this methane becomes it's a methyl group here the table of content for uh, number of carbon is one that is C1 it's methyl methyl here CH3, CH2, ethyl and propane, one hydrogen removed, it's propyl. Then butyl, pentyl, hexyl, heptyl, like it's increases. Now, formation of alkyl group. How the alkyl group forms? An alkane can result in the form, formation of one or more alkyls and the types of alkyl formed depends upon the nature of the carbon atoms bonded with hydrogen atoms. Ethane gives ethyl group when one hydrogen atom is removed from the molecules. Look at this chain. H3C, CH3, it's one degree, one degree. Removal of hydrogen from one degree carbon. There's one degree carbon, it becomes H3C, CH2. The CH3, one hydrogen removed. Ethane becomes ethyl. Next, propane is like 
from this one hydrogen is removed from the end of this CH3 so it becomes H3C CH2 CH2 so it becomes propane it becomes propyl group that is iso that is R propyl group then same propane is becomes removal of hydrogen it becomes N butyl group propane and becomes secondary propyl group two ways of forming here from one degree carbon is atom is removed here CH3 CH2 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 here that removal of hydrogen from second degree CH3 that is CH3 CH CH2 CH2 then it is connected with other so it becomes butyl group now isobutane is formed like alkyl cations free alkyls can exist in the form of cations and these cations are called carbocations. These can be generated using strong acids and contains a positively charged carbon atoms. Carbocation can be primary, secondary and tertiary depending upon the nature of the carbon atoms. Look at here. So methyl car carbocation that is here positive carbon then it becomes ethyl carbocations means here CH, CH3 is added this one it becomes ethyl carbocation now also propyl carbocation like so look at here CH3H3H CH3, and CH3 here one more CH3 added by removing one hydrogen it becomes tertiary butyl carbocation next alkyl anions Free alkyl can also exist in the form of anions the, and these anions are called carbonions. If positives removed, that's carbocations. Negatives removed, it's carbonions. This contains a negatively charged carbon atoms and can be generated using among base, strong bases. Look at here. This is methane carbocation and the, instead of this H removed CH3 added ethyl carbonion. Methyl carbonion is ethyl carbonion. If you want to study more such topics, that means about uh, alkyl groups, we can go through more videos in our section. The symbol R is used here throughout organic chemistry to represent a generalized organic group. The R group can be methyl, ethyl, propyl or any of a multitude of others. We have done. Please subscribe our YouTube channel.